Welcome to this session of Turtle Art in Python. What we're using today is Python 3.0, which is the programming language. Also, I'm using a IDE called PyCharm that you can download from IntelliJ. I'll put a link in the comments below to a tutorial on how you can download and update your software if it's not the same as mine, or you need a newer version. So let's start by creating a new project. And what we need to do is create a folder. And I'm going to create a folder on my desktop. So I'm going to click on the folder, go to desktop, go new folder. And I'm just going to call this, and I'm going to call this turtle drawing. And then I'm going to open this folder. Make sure that you're using Python 3.x. So I'm using Python 3.8 interpreter. As long as you got this or newer, if you download the new version, it will give you the latest suite of code. And once you're at 3.x, click on create. Now this will take a moment or two to set up as it's a new folder. And you can see that we've got a folder on our desktop called Turtle Drawing. What we'd like to do is start a new Python file. So I'm going to right mouse click, go new, and then Python file. We need to give it a name. Now you can call your files anything you want other than Turtle. So don't call it Turtle. So let's call this intro. Now the reason for that is we would like to import the turtle module. So we need to use the command import and then we can use turtle. Now if we call the file itself turtle, then it'll be trying to open itself and that won't go too well. So after we've imported the turtle, what we want to do is some basic commands. So one of the first one is turtle. We need to tell the turtle what to do and we want to go forward. And then we can actually use an open bracket and a close bracket. And in there, we can tell it how far to move forwards. I like to think of them as pixels. So say move 100 pixels forward. The other thing we want to do is go turtle, exit, on, click. Bracket, bracket. This way, we need to click on the screen when we want the program to end. So let's run this by right mouse clicking and going run intro. Now you can see Python has drawn a line here. So this is our turtle and you can see a straight line coming through. If I resize and move that to the center, you can see it a lot easier. Now the program will draw a straight line, so forward 100. So the turtle started here, moved forward 100 and then stopped. And the next line says exit on click. So the program's waiting for us to click on the screen somewhere because when I left mouse click, it disappears. Now we may want it to look more like a turtle. So what I'm going to do is click back up here on line two and then I'm going to go turtle and then I'm going to say the shape and then I'm going to tell it to be a turtle. So when the program runs this time, you can see now that our turtle is actually a turtle. Now there are some other shapes, you can explore them when you've got a little bit of time. Now we would like to write our programs between the top part and the end turtle. So what I'm going to do is put a, put a blank line here and also a blank line here. We can also change the speed at which the turtle draws. So we can actually say turtle dot speed and then we can tell the turtle to go slow or fast. So let's put in nine at the moment and let's see what happens. You'll notice the turtle moved pretty quick. Let's do it this time and put the speed of one in there. Yep, now it's moving more like a turtle. So if you want the turtle to go slow, you could have it at one. If you want it to go as fast as you possibly can, you can set it to 10. And that's a pretty quick turtle. It might even win the race now. So if I want to get the turtle to change directions, we can just go turtle. And I can say left. And then I can give it some degrees. So we could say 90 degrees. This way, the turtle will turn left if it's facing this way, be pointing up the screen. And then I could tell it to move forward again by copying this line here and pacing it down here. Let's have a look. Now remember the turtle's going as fast as he can. So I might just slow him down 
and turn it to five. So you can see the turtle went along 100, did a left hand turn of 90 degrees and went up 100. We can also turn the turtle right. So if we wanted to, we can go turtle. And then give it some degrees as well and say 90. And then we'll tell it to go forward again 100. So let's have a look at the turtle now and we'll slow him down just a little bit more to two. In this presentation, you can see the turtle actually did some turning. Okay, in this tutorial, we've looked at importing the turtle module, changing the shape of our turtle, adjusting the speed of our turtle, and also how to go forward and turn left and right. And most importantly, we've added a line that says exit on click to ensure that it stays on screen until we're ready for the program to end. So I hope you found this tutorial useful. If you did, Give it a like, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and now you can go do some drawings with a turtle.